What's up, YouTube? Jeff from the Graph Life, as promised. Gonna go and unbox these. Now, these are the extras. Uh, so, I'll probably put them in a giveaway at some point. Not really sure what I'm gonna do with them, but I have Pat Burrow, Jimmy Rollins, Chase Utley, um, Severino, Brett Gardner. Uh, who else is in here? I'm missing. Uh, no, that's it. Yeah, so it's Pat Burrow. Jimmy Rollins, Brett Gardner, Severino. Uh, probably, I think Rick Shue, maybe, is another one that I have an extra of. I'm not really certain. But to unbox the ones that I did not show off, and then I'll show you the final um, presentation of them, since they're all kind of a puzzle, we'll open up Gary Sanchez here. Show you a look at him. I, You know, I don't know. I, I had a lot going on this summer. A lot of weddings, a lot of friends got married, stuff like that. Uh, just other events going on that I wanted to go to and baseball happens nearly every day uh, so knowing that I had this bobblehead plan <clears throat> uh, and I was guaranteed to get the bobbleheads I really didn't go crazy uh, making sure that I got to every game but uh, I did get to most of them I really hate styrofoam <laughs> it sticks to everything I, mean, I got it all over the place but here we go Unboxing this bad boy. Ooh, stuck on me. Stuck everywhere. <laughs> ah, get out of there. There we go. So, we got that out of there. Thankfully, not that big of a mess. But that's the only bad thing. I like I like the the, um, the plastic ones. I have a plastic hole, a holder inside there. I like those. So, okay. Here's Gary Sanchez. Dust myself off a little bit. Here he is. Gary Sanchez. There it is. All-time SWB team. The 30 years. There's his nameplate. And if you look at the helmet, that's the uh, Vegigante nameplate for Spanish Heritage Month. Um, pretty cool bobblehead. You know, it's got the haircut too. El Gary's haircut. You know, pretty decent on there. So there he is. El Gary. The Kraken. Gary Sanchez. Throw him in his spot. <clears throat> Next up that I missed, the big guy, Ryan Howard. Uh, now, a lot of people are like, wait, I thought that Scranton was the Yankees affiliate. Well, they are the Yankees affiliate, but they were the Phillies affiliate um, up until, I believe, 2006, I believe, is the last year of the Phillies affiliate. That's when I went away to college, kind of slowed down with all of my collecting. Uh, including just straight up card collecting. I, I really slowed down a lot uh, in college and then uh, once I got finished with that, got my degree, I, uh, I picked it back up. I mean, I, I didn't stop completely. I, I just didn't, you know, try and pick anything up as frequent as I do now. Uh, but Ryan Howard was a monster. I mean, he was hitting home runs like crazy. Uh, there were talks that... Uh, they were looking to trade him. The Pirates were big into him at the time. All kinds of rumors being uh, thrown around. I did get the chance to meet him and get his autograph. Only got it one time, though. And it was on a giveaway magnet. Uh, I have it somewhere around here. It's not on my fridge, I'll tell you that. But um, Anyway, here's the bobblehead here. See, an all-time SWV team. Doesn't really look like him. I mean, it's it's decent, but, you know... Ryan Howard, I don't know. It's it's close to what he looks like. The nose is pretty big, so I, but I I think they could have done a little bit better job. Uh, must be him doing a curtain call, which he did quite frequently. Hit an awful lot of home runs. Uh, really slender though, very slim. He was a big guy. I mean this this does not do him justice. I feel like they could have done a little bit of a better job on this, but I'm not going to complain too much. We'll throw him in his spot at first base. And the last one that I missed is probably the biggest guy uh, to ever play in Scranton. Now he's patrolling right field for the Yankees. Court is in session. Aaron Judge. So, um, crazy I missed like three of the biggest names um, that they had in the giveaway. But that's just the way it worked out. I didn't really 
you know, plan to miss. I just, you know, life, there's a lot, <clears throat> a lot going on in life. And sometimes, you know, baseball, autographing, card collecting, <coughs> that's got to take a back seat because there are way more, <coughs> excuse me, important things than that, even though it is fun and you have to have some fun or else you'll go crazy. You don't have to go crazy with the fun, you, you know. Uh, and plus, most of the things that I had to do, like weddings and stuff, they're fun too, <laughs> in their own way. Uh, so here we go, number 99 in his Rail Riders uniform, all-time SWB. Aaron Judge, looks like he's getting ready to throw with that cannon for an arm in right field, throw somebody out um, <clears throat> around the bases. Pretty. I mean, I, I like this one. It's not too bad. It's chipped right here. But, um, you know, it's for my collection. I don't really mind. It's not broken, so that's good. Um, uh, I, I think they did an all right job with them. Um, probably could have been a little taller, you know, if I had to make a critique. But, um, yeah, that's Aaron Judge there. He's going out into right field. And uh, I'll show you the all-time... SWB team, let me bring you over here. My desk is really messy, but we'll we'll show it off to you here. Let's see. Move some stuff around. Can you see that? I don't know. What do we got? There they are. I got Gary Sanchez, Luis Severino, <clears throat> Ryan Howard, Chase Utley, Jimmy Rollins, Rick Shue, Pat Burrell, Brett Gardner's hanging out back here, and... Aaron Judge. Now the crazy thing is, look at this infield here. First base, second base, and shortstop. Six, six, six. They weren't very creative at handing out the numbers in Scranton. Uh, and Utley actually played with Howard, so I'm not really sure how that worked out, how they were able to all be number six. But that's apparently the way it was. I don't know. Rollins was before them, um, but Howard and Utley definitely played on the same team, or at least you know for a little while. Uh, but there it is. The uh, Here's a different view of it. Top view so we can get Brett Gardner in there. That is the all-time 30 years SWB team. Whew. So hope you, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, and eventually I will do a tour of the whole entire room. Um, hopefully soon. I mean, I can't make guarantees. Got the Irish hat on. Um, <laughs> I don't know why I just said that, but whatever. I mean... I will do a tour once I get it cleaned up. I mean, I just have cards everywhere. I mean, there's this stuff all over the place, bobbleheads, all kinds of stuff. So once I get it cleaned up a little bit, which could take months, I keep saying it's going to be soon. It'll be soon. I don't know if it's going to be soon, but thank you for watching. That's my bobblehead video. I'll see you next video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you next time.